howdy, and a big welcome back to Yaks for Gaming, everybody, as once more we're going to pick up the Mike Thompson closing pitching road to the show here. You know, he's up one game to none over Fresno, so why not get going into our next appearance and, oh well, never mind. Okay, well that was, uh, that was a great performance by the Fresno Grizzlies there to take the next three after the Ice Tops loss. And it looks like Mike Thompson's year is going to be over. He's not going to get that call to the show. And would you like to stop simulating? No, I would not. And the Astros defeat the Pirates in the 2015 World Series. Well, go figure. Okay, that's, uh, that's kind of disappointing. Big time disappointing. And we'll see what he can upgrade. We'll upgrade. How about that control on the curveball? And there we go. So, Latroy Hopkins is 76. Mike Thompson is 70. Ken Hanna is 75 adjusted. Okay. So, here we go. We've got no options. So, let's begin the offseason by viewing the retired players. And it looks like Latroy Hopkins, at 61 overall adjusted, has retired. That's good news. We're the next in line. And David Ortiz has retired. Anyone else? R.A. Dickey, anyone else because of age, Scott Atchison and Scott Downs, Joe Nathan has retired, oh god, uh, Tori Hunter finally, and Ichiro Suzuki's gone, Bartolo Colon, and anyone else, oh, Randy Choate, Joel Peralta for the Dodgers, and that's really it, Tim Hudson. Okay, and Hall of Fame inductees, Suzuki and Ortiz. Good enough. Let's simulate offseason and let's view our contract offer. Got 82000 to become the AAA closer again. Okay, that's going to be a tough one, so let's negotiate. How about go upwards of... 97 and that brings them up to 88.5 so we'll go down to 95 and we should be able to settle at 93.50 oh no 92.25 and there we go 92.500 they're perfect that's what we needed so we're back with the Rockies and they've got Coborn and the other two okay Coborn is obviously a free agent acquisition. It's nice to see. And we'll simulate the offseason here and figure out where we're going to end up. We should get an invitation to AAA, or not to AAA, to spring training, pardon me. And that would be big for Mike Thompson's career, of course, coming out of Irma last year and now having that chance to play in spring training, possibly. Let's see. Pitching rotation. Mike Thompson is a minor relief pitcher in the spring training for situation. So, a lot of pitchers, but we'll see exactly where he uh, gets an opportunity. Of course, we've got the opportunity to retire now, given any injuries or anything. So, here we go. Play next appearance, and he's going to get in in the top half of the sixth. As the Colorado Rockies lead 3-2. to two. So Thompson's going to fire in his first ever big league spring appearance. It's going to be a good time for him. Of course, in that Rockies spring training uniform. Hopefully have a good enough spring he can prove he belongs in the majors. I didn't look to see who the closer for the Rockies is nowadays. But we'll find that out in just a short few minutes. As we got to get through the game. Oh, look at that hair looking all good in the wind. All right, against A.J. Pollock. He's going to fire in his first ball of the spring. And then with the fast ball, that'll be hit on the ground to the first baseman who will run over just in time to get the out. Perfect. That's the way he likes it. Charlie Connor will get you out as well. Nope, first pitch ball again. Okay. We'll go circle change once more. There's a strike. Perfect. And another pitch outside for a ball. So Thompson really doesn't have his control early on here. There's a pitch. 
Now we should be able to go outside with that breaking ball and get some for the strikeout. Mike Thompson's first career spring training strikeout. So we'll go with the circle change again. And it's going to be laced right to the center fielder. That should be down for just a single. So a bad little pitch there from Thompson. Bad location. And he's got to work out of trouble now with two outs here in the top half of the sixth. Pitch. There's two strikes quickly, and he's going to go outside with that curveball. Oh, catch him checking, boys. Bingo. Chase Anderson comes on, and that'll be it for Mike Thompson. As he gets, should have gotten a hold. Game recap, box score. Mike Thompson, yeah, he gets a hold. A lot of guys got a hold. Holy. Lots of guys got into action as the Rockies ended up winning 4-3 to three in this one. So we'll take a look at the depth chart and see where Thompson sits in the roster overall. Of course, he had those two strikeouts in this appearance, so not a half bad little appearance for him. And he's got some training points, and he is the top closer. So that is potentially what they're going with is Mike Thompson. Take a look at the pitching rotation. They have Adam Otavino. He's a relief pitcher who's had four years experience. He's set up to be the closer. Don't know if that's going to stay true, but we'll see. So guys, I'd like to thank you for tuning in to this edition of the Mike Thompson Closing Pitcher Road to the Show. As always, if you're new, feel free to subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, leave a like on the video. And we'll catch you in the next one, guys. So long from Yak City.